from the Gospel of Luke 23, verse 46. And it was about noon, and darkness came over the whole land until the three in the afternoon. Because of the eclipse of the sun, and the veil of the <coughs> temple was torn because down the turn. middle. And when Jesus had cried with a loud voice, he said, Father, into your hands I commend my spirit. And having said this, he breathed his last. Let's welcome again our last speaker, Father Jojo. Good. Ah. So, Okay, just go. Yes, yes. Yes, Diba? Ah, uh, hindi. Kasi alam niyo, ah, uh, marami na akong natin na na, Oy, hey, okay, yung sinabi niyo, pati, okay, okay. Paglabas, paglabas, wala na alala. Eh, pan lang yun, ano? Kasi tayo dito, ang problema nga natin mga katoliko is because we never leave our faith. Ano? We never really had put it into practice. Huh? Why is the Philippines the poorest nation in the in this in this part of the world? Why? Why? Because it's the only Christian country in this place. No, it's because we do not practice what we believe. Huh? We never practice what we believe. We flow according to how things flow. Kung lagayan dyan, maglagay rin tayo. Okay. Uh, kung wala nakakakita dyan, o, di pwedeng gawin. Oh. No, no, no. Wala, no. Things has to change. Because we are now new creation. And this is the second part. Yeah? Father, into your hands I commend my spirit. But that's not a very... I, I believe... Uh, John, the Gospel of John puts it better. Ano? I commend my spirit, that means I give my spirit. But here in John, I would like to, to say again, ano? after Jesus said, it is finished, he bow his head, he handed over the spirit. Okay? I commend my spirit, I give my spirit to God, okay? But here, bowing his head, he handed over the spirit. That means he gives away that spirit. Okay? That's in John. Okay? May difference ang konti sa kanya emphasis. It's giving and here is commend. Uh, surrender. Surrender. Yes. Same, the same. Ano? I commend my spirit into your hands. But the, the thing is, yung us kanina niya binibigay. Okay? Here is to the Father, Father. But here is to all. So, for John, for John, the descent of the Holy Spirit is here. This time. Okay? Hindi yung time na yung the 12 apostles and the other disciples gathered together and that the, 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 the spirit. The yeah, it's in the Acts of the Apostles. Ano? No, no, no. For John, it's here. Huh? The giving of the spirit is here. Because it's connected to how to become a new creation. Ha? Paano tayo magiging ganap na bagong nilikha sa mata ng Diyos? It's not only the time when Jesus died, but precisely on His death, 
He gave His Spirit. Okay? So, tanong, oh, makinig kayo, ha? napakalaga nito sa ating uh, spiritual buhay. Ano ibig sabihin ngayon ng to live in His Spirit? Ha? According to John, kung titingnan natin yung buhay ni Jesus dito, ha? if you will read it, ha? nagbabasa naman kayo ng Biblia, no? O subukan naman yung basahin yung buong Biblia ni, kwa, ni uh, according to John. Ano? Basahin niyo may ikiyan. Kasi makikita niyo dito sa kanyang narration. Kalimitan, nagsasalita dito si Jesus about his time. My time has not yet come. Okay? Kalimitan sinasabi niyo yun. Oh? Kung makikita niyo yun, underline niyo lahat yun. Bilangin niyo. Ha? Huh? Oh, next time, sabihin niyo sa akin kung ilan. <laughs> Next year. Para makita ko naman nagbabasa talaga kayo. Oh. Next year na, Father. Next year, next year. Oh. Sabihin niyo sa akin Assignment. kung ilan yung time. It's not my time. Ano? It is my time. Sabihin niyo rin sa akin. Oo, oh, lahat-lahat nung merong sinasabi ni Jesus patungkol sa Kanya. Ha? Huh? Na hindi pa niya oras. Okay? Pero nung panahon na sinabi niya yung it's now my time, things happen na. Ano? Okay. This is the the Bible is saying the difference between our time. Ano? The way we see our time and the way the Bible sees the time. Ano? Ito yung tinatawag nila sa ating punto de vista ang tawag natin doon ay chronos chronology. Ano? Yung pagkakasunod-sunod ng oras. Ano? Ang kairos is another way of looking at time. What is kairos? Kairos means God's timing. Ha? Huh? Oh. Kapag sinabi natin kairos, oh, ito sinasabing oras ng Panginoon. Ha? Huh? Tatlong Tatlong bagay ang dapat natin tandaan doon. Ano? It's the Father, the Son, and the, the Holy, Holy Spirit. Spirit. Ano? All working together at that time. Ha? Kaya kung sinabi ni Jesus na it's my time, it means, or it's not my time, it means, makinig kayo may kaya, first, it pertains to the Father. Ayan, ang galing. <laughs> May popping uh, effects pa tayo dito. <laughs> Wala pa sasabog dyan. <laughs> no, joke lang. Ikaw naman. Joke, joke lang ako. Joke, joke lang ako. Masyado ko naman seryoso. Oh, oh, makita natin, dito sinasabi dito, first and foremost, the time that he is talking about is about the Father. Ano? I commend my spirit. He's talking about the time he has with the Father. And what does the Father do with regards to this Kairos? It is God the Father who finishes everything. Sinabi natin kanina, you finish. Who created everything? It's God the Father. Okay? But creation does not stop with God alone. It's not God the Father alone. It's also with the Word of God. It's Jesus. So, makinig kayo may ha? Medyo malalim na nito ng konti. Kasi gusto ko i-share sa inyo kung paano ibig sabihin to live in the Spirit of Christ. Ha? And that means to live as a new creation. Makinig kayo may ige. Kasi it has something to do with the Trinity. With our God. With how God works in us. Because we are in time. Remember, we are always in time. Pero kailangan natin malalaman, na ito nga ba ang oras ko? Ha? And that is very important in making decisions in our lives. Because in certain times in our lives, we have to make a certain decisions that would make or break. Ha? So to live in a new creation is a decision of timing. So, makinig kayo may again. So, God the Father, 
God the Father is the one who has the plan, who knows when it is finished. Okay? He is the one. Okay? Kaya nga, Jesus, He always refers to His Father. Huh? He always refers to His Father in saying, Ah, this is not yet my time. It depends on the Father. Huh? Okay? Because He has the plan. He is the one who finishes everything. That's why in this time, it's finished. Because that is the time appointed by God for Him. Yun nila ibig sabihin ng it is finished. It refers to God the Father. Okay? It refers also to the Spirit of God. Huh? Ito ha? Father, the Spirit. Okay? It refers, the timing has something to do with the Spirit. And what does the Spirit do? Ito makinig kayo ha? Uh, lahat ba kayong marunong kumanta? Hindi oh. <laughs> lang sure, Father. Anong importante sa kanta? Tuno. Ah, mali. Chorus. Lyrics, lyrics. <laughs> no, 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 no. <laughs> hindi, hindi toro. Kahit out of tune ka. Breath. 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 Hindi, hindi rin lyrics. Kasi oh, pwede maglalalalalala. Breath. So, may sinabi dito. Rhythm. 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 Ang tempo. Kapag wala ka sa tempo, kahit na hindi, tama yung tono mo, tama yung lyrics mo, paano kang sasabay sa iba? Ha? Ang tempo mo ay salang-sala. Ha? Okay. The timing of God needs rhythm. May tamang tempo yan. And it's only the Spirit who gives that rhythm. He is the one who guides that rhythm. Yan ang ginagamit sa piano. Okay? May tanong kayo? <laughs> bakit away ka na pa? Ay, bakit na nanimig kayo? <laughs> Uh, ay, ay, huwag lang kayong makinig. Mag-isip-isipin mag kayo at magtanong kayo. Alam? Oo. Oh, oh. <laughs> Tama. Kaya nga ngayon, binibili ko na sa inyo. Hindi naman kayo nagtatanong. Oo. Pinoso po ka rin, ha? <laughs> tama, tama siya. Tama. Tama sa akin. Uh, so, the Spirit of God is the one who gives the rhythm of how we shall perceive God's timing. Okay? So, anong ibig sabihin nito in our concrete lives? Ano? First, we should consider in all our lives now that the Father has everything. Ano? So, when we pray to God, we pray to the Father to grant us the grace. The grace. Ano? In His mercy. Because it's only through His mercy that we can approach Him. Because He is the Creator. He's holy. Holy means what? Set apart. Set apart. Set apart. He is over and above us. You can never control God. Okay? He is the one in control. Okay? Ibig sabihin nun, kapag tayo nagdadasal at nananalangin, O paano natin gagawin ang pagiging isang new creation? The new creation is a humble creation because we are all under Him. Okay? Ngayon, ano ang gagawin mo sa buhay mo? O paano mong pabuhayin yan? You have to follow the rhythm of the Spirit. Okay, naiintindihan niyo ba ako? Parang hindi naman kayo nakikinig eh. Yes, Father! Uh, parang uh, first time nyo lang narinig to. Right? Right? First time nyo lang. 
First time of father? And rhythm is we know we use in the piano. No, but so, it has it has something to do with our lives. Yes. Okay. So, kapag wala ka sa timing, ha? Sala. Sala. Kaya makasalanan. Sala. Magkakasala. Magkakasala. Precisely. Sin means sala. Sala. You miss the point. Okay? Yes. But if we follow God's word, if we follow his will, we are always in timing. We don't miss the point. We will not sin. That word, we will not sin. Ay, hindi totoo yan, Father. Lagi tayo magkakasaran, no? Huh? Because we believe the new creation. It's possible. Amen. Okay? Oh. May tanaw. Malapit na. <laughs> so, masabi na nga natin, yung Father, yung Spirit, yung sun okay what's the disposition uh, what's the what's the part of the sun with regards the kairos sa time okay what does what is Jesus' part here huh he perform perform uh, not exactly huh no 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 that's that's very good, huh? You give this this kind of one, this kind of uh, feedback, so, no? Because it's very important that you really understand, ano? Na importante na natin. It's not, it's not. Ano sabi mo? Perform. It's not to perform. Presencia. Precisely, it's the opposite of performing, huh? Makini kayo, ah? It's the opposite of performing. It's not that you do something. No, 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 no. The Lord said, God rested. Diba? What does it mean to rest? Ano? Uh, because it's finished. Ano? Yeah, he finished. Ano? And rested. It means, it is, listen to this. To rest means to be dispose ourselves before God. To dispose first ourselves before God. When you dispose, you don't act, you, know, you don't act, do immediately something. You, know? you open your hearts and you dispose yourself to God. And that's the role of Jesus, is to be an open book to God the Father. Huh? So before you do something, you know, problem natin, gusto pa natin gawin. You know? No, 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 no. It's not your work. Huh? The creation is not our work. Huh? So it's God's work. Everything is God's work. So all of these things will happen because God is working in you. And that God cannot work in you if you don't dispose yourselves to Him. Okay, Father. Okay? It's hard, but we have to do it. Oh, that's the hardest part. Yes. Uh, that's the hardest part in our yes. in our own yes. spiritual life. Yes, Father. Because that means to stop, give up what you want to do, and let God possess you. Amen. Because you are disposed to God. And that's what it means, new creation. Okay? When you do that, you will always be on time. Hindi yung late lagi. Ah, may hindi tayo sa late. Pilipino, lagi late. Di ba ka? Ah. Oo naman siya.
May tanong kayo? Wala, Father, but we have to put in our heart. Okay. So, God has given us, Jesus has given us the Father, the Spirit, and Himself. Ano? I commend my spirit. This is the meaning of the whole thing. Ano? This word means that. He gave everything. Huh? So, when we read these passages, let's call it to mind. Huh? This is the last word of Jesus. Sabi nga nila, ang taong namamatay, ang uling salita ay napakahalaga. Di po ba? Nakita nyo kung gano'ng kahalaga. Na Naintindihan nyo ba kung bakit mahalaga yung sinabi ni Jesus? Nakitas nyo? Yes, Father. Ako ngayon, tatanungin po kayo, yes kayo na yes. Ha? Bakit mahalaga? Hello, no, malas? <laughs> malas kasi ikaw na timing <laughs> oh, Sige, sige, sige oh, ah, Sabi ko kanina ha, Napakalaga ng iyong sinasabi Kapag ikaw ay matitikok na ano? Kapag ikaw ay matitikok na Yung sasabihin mo Dapat eh, malaman-laman Kote, ano? Uy po ba? Okay? Oh. Oh, yan. Ito sinabi ni Jesus, yung uli salita niyan yan. Ah, ano kalagahan ba? Sa sinabi natin kanina, ano bang para sa iyo, tatay? Uh, Father, yung, yung po is, uh, Father, into your hands, I commend my spirit. It is finished. It is finished. Okay. So, <laughs> ibig sabihin, Father, uh, lahat ng ginawa mong paghirap sa buhay, yung mga pinagdaanan mo, Ah, uh, ibinigay mo na kay Lord. It means it's finished na lahat, Lord. At finished na po 'yon. So, ibig sabihin po, ah, uh, yung paghihirap mo, ah, uh, natapos natapos na kasi binigay mo na kay Lord lahat 'yon. So, ito na po is finished. Hindi ko tapusin mo na sinasabi mo. Parang ako matitikok sa sinasabi mo. <laughs> Uh, okay, very good. That's wonderful, ha? Huh? Yung personal experience niya, no? Okay, ano pa? Ang, ang sa akin din, Father, kapag matapos na ang malapit na akong mamatay, ang sa akin, uh, masaya ako, Father, dahil makakapiling ko na ang Panginoon. It is finished in my life. Uh, kasi hindi yun ang sinabi ko kanina. <laughs> Kaya na, nalulugot ako ng konti. Ayun. Parang, uh, sige, ayaw ko na. <laughs> Hindi ko sinasabi, mali yung sinasabi, mali yung sinasabi niyo. Tama yun, it's very good. Pero, uh, yun na nga, sali yata yung aking pagsasabi. Ano? Baka hindi nyo na-gets kung gano'ng kahalagay yung sinabi ko. Oh, yun, 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 yun. Sige, sige, sige. Ano yung tanong ko? Na ito, ito yung it is finished at saka itong salita ng Diyos na ito. Ano nga bang kahalagahan niya? Ha? Ano? Na, 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 let, me, let me say something about what you're as telling me, ha? Kasi this is very good uh, feedbacks. No? Kasi yes. nakikita ko kung paano nyo nagkikets yung sinasabi ko. So, at sinasabi nyo dito is uh, my situation now, makasalanan ako at kapag sinabi it's finished, it's the Lord's, everything oh. is in His hand. And, oh. Oh. <laughs> no. Yeah. That's not what I'm trying to say here. Yes. <laughs> huh? What I'm trying to say, itong gusto kong pabot sa inyo. Huh? It's not about not doing anything. It's not about not sinning. No, 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 no. I'm trying to tell you that now we are new creations. Huh? And to live as new creation, we should live in the trinity of the God's timing. Huh? 
sa panahon sa panahon na itinagma ng ating Ama at ang Espiritu Santo sa kanyang tamang timing oh, by disposing ourselves to the Father. Okay? Gawin nyo yun. Kasi yun yung pinakamalaga. It's not about you avoiding sin. No, no. Because you will avoid sin. You will not sin if you do that. It's not about your solving your problems now. No. Those problems will fall into its place. It will fall to its place because you are in the timing of God. Oh, I see. Like you Yes, Oh, okay. So, okay. Paki We are all in timing. This is very important. Ano? It's good that you are giving out these things. I'm just going back again. Ano? I would just reiterating some things that I've said already because that's the most important thing about our spiritual life. Okay? It's meaning to say it's the kenosis. It's the emptying of yourselves. It's not easy. Huh? Yeah. Because you have to empty all yourselves about yourselves. Uh, because yeah, nakita nyo, ah, we have a lot of worries about our sin, about our problem, yung utang ko, yung aking amo, yung... Uh, marami tayong problema eh. Yes. That's okay? That we miss the point. <laughs> First, you empty yourself about this and let his. That's difficult. That's difficult. You cannot fool God because he's over and above us. Okay? So, ibig sabihin noon, kapag siya ay dumating sa buhay natin, <laughs> You cannot put him in a box. Think about that. And make up Thank you, Father Jojo, for the last two last words na ini-impart mo sa amin at nawa ay may sa buhay namin para mag-transform kami na maging new creation sandali lang, sandali lang sana magawa namin no? this is another wrong way of doing it listen, listen, listen when God created the whole thing were you there? No. No. Yes. no. It's all this work. Yes. Yes. Right. Yes. This is very important. Huh? It is only his work. We, we, we didn't contribute anything. Huh? Wala tayong contribution doon. Kung kaya nga, uh, ano sinabi mo kanina? Sana ma magawa namin ito. Uh, it's a wrong way of thinking because it seems that you are the one making something. You are the one creating something. No! 
It's God's creation. God's new creation is God's work. So that means you should think, how could I dispose? How could I empty myself from myself so that God could be totally in me? Yes. Yeah, thank you, Father, for the invitation. All right.